COUNTY JURY HAS GONE HOME FOR THE NIGHT WITHOUT REACHING A VERDICT IN THE MURDER TRIAL OF GAVIN BROWN. BROWN IS ON TRIAL FOR THE FIRST DEGREE MURDER IN THE STABBING DEATH OF DJ JERRY SMITH JR. IN AN ORLANDO NIGHTCLUB LAST JUNE. WEST NEWS BOB KEELING HAS BEEN AT THE COURTHOUSE ALL EVENING AND HE JOINS US NOW WITH THE VERY LATEST. AND BOB, WE KNOW JURORS CAME BACK WITH A QUESTION. Yeah, they did, Brett. And uh, from that comment to the judge, it's clear that they're not all on the same page uh, in terms of deciding this murder suspect's fate. And because of that, uh, just a little bit earlier, uh, the suspect Brown was put back into ha uh, handcuffs and led out of the courtroom. Uh, jurors had deliberated for about three and a half to four hours before being sent home for the night. Uh, they're weighing whether this was self defense, as Brown claims, uh, in this young disc jockey's killing, or whether Brown is guilty of first degree murder or perhaps second degree or manslaughter. Uh, at around nine o'clock, the judge came back and read this question from the jurors. What happens if only one juror does not agree? Uh, so clearly there is one holdout juror, but uh, to what we don't know at this point, Judge Jennifer Davis deciding it had been a long enough day uh, and sent the jurors home. Um, they will reconvene after some court business in the morning the judge has to take care of. They'll reconvene at 1.30 in the afternoon to decide uh, about the question, then presumably resume the deliberations. Earlier in the day, the prosecution showed a surveillance video from the Tier nightclub. They say is proof that this was first Degree premeditated murder. Reporting live at the Orange County Courthouse, Bob Keeling, West 2 News on CW18.